please, Lord Jesus, give me memes, but make them vegan. Gonna post this in r slash clever comebacks. The perfect lipstick for vegans. Gorilla glue. That's some powerful stuff. Yeah, because vegans just need to shut up. <laughs> Damn, all sold out. Turns out the Omnis were using it as eyeliner instead. <laughs> Hashtag ignorance is bliss. I think it goes without saying that Grace Hughes is a salad. The truth doesn't apply to me if I can't see it. <laughs> I wish all meat and dairy industries a very pleasant bankruptcy. <gasps> now, now. When people are like, <laughs> So what? You just want all animal agriculture industry just like out of business? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Just because an industry exists doesn't mean that it should continue to exist just because it generates jobs for people. There are so many industries that existed at one point that like, I am so glad don't exist anymore. Should we just um, bring them back? You know, because uh, jobs though. I want a tuxedo like Bugs Bunny. We must honor our cultures and traditions. The it's how my ancestors ate starter kit. It is incredible how people say this, but a lot of the time they are consuming things like pizzas, hot dogs, drumsticks, burgers, bacon strips. As well as this, even if they were just kind of just chopping up dead body pieces and eating them raw, animals now are quite far removed from what they would have been a long time ago. We selectively braid them and change traits about them. But you know what? Uh, if I looked back at my ancestry, they probably did some pretty abhorrent things, either out of desperation or just because that was the time. And during those times, they did those bad things. Or maybe some of them were actually evil. Just because they did stuff doesn't mean I'm going to do it too. The, you know what I mean? Oldie but goldie. Pescatarian when you need a fancy word to describe the kind of animals you murder. Whoa, 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 don't use the word murder. God, that's reserved for human beings. You can't make people think about the weight of actually killing animals. If you attribute a loaded term to it, they might actually start thinking about the repercussions of killing an animal and what that entails. Like this post to cure their addiction. Ah, uh, dairy. The veal when her mother secretes milk. For me. Oh no. Cheese breathers. For us. For us. I wish I could do his voice. Yes, we, we, we meant for us. Thankfully, I'm entitled to my facts-based opinion. It's a valid point though. Birds, rodents, and various bugs are killed in the process of growing vegetables. Since we require a lot of feed for the billions of livestock animals, much more birds, rodents, etc. are killed for a non-vegan diet. Not what I've read, but you're entitled to your opinion. <laughs> that would be brilliant at that point to show what you've read to be like, Okay, well, you're actually wrong. Rather than, not the thing I've read, um, I can't remember what I really read or even where I read it, or whether it was valid. Um, but God, I didn't. So you're entitled to your opinion, whatever. That looks like TikTok to me. God almighty TikTok. Let me know in the comments section if you'd like me to do another TikTok video, because the TikTok comments I get are just unbelievable. I might have to start like dedicating videos to the nonsense I get over there. It's just like, Oh my god. I might end up like the carny crew and start suffering stress-induced constipation. Like, I feel it coming. Who else hates playing Carnist Bingo in every non-vegan subreddit? Oh, Carnist Bingo. At least the odds are in your favour. The chances I'd go vegan would be higher if vegans vegetarians never told me I'll burn in hell for eating meat. I've known one vegetarian who didn't say that. I think I'm just gonna roll my eyes infinitely until they leave my body. I don't want them anymore. Let's stop doing this thing that negatively affects an uninvolved party. If this party over here wouldn't hurt my feelings. No cow, no pig, no chicken, no duck, no horse has told you that you're gonna burn in hell if you eat their flesh. So why are you taking out your frustration on them? Most vegans I know uh, aren't religious. I'm not gonna tell you that you're gonna burn in hell for eating animals because I'm not even sure if the concept of hell even exists. I don't know what circles you've been hanging around in. Maybe it's just like literally you've seen one person say it and you've decided, oh, that means all the vegans say it. Yeah, yeah, I've only seen one who doesn't. How many of you actually spoke it to? That's a pretty silly thing to say. Just because some people from an already small group were mean to you, you're less likely to make an ethical choice. Sounds like you're just trying to justify what you know is wrong. Oh yeah. I'm a being of spite, and the more people make me angry, the more I desire to spite them in any way I can. I mean, at least you admit it, but that's god awful. 
Like, that's actually despicable behaviour. You're not spiting a vegan. You're spiting animals. That's all you're doing. It doesn't affect us. You're not doing anything to us. You're just contributing to an already massive, perpetually evil industry. Who's affected by that? Animals. Congrats, you're the annoying vegan. I don't get that. Is that supposed to be aimed at the, the vegan? I don't, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Well, I don't think you'd burn in hell for eating animals. People eat the body of Christ every now and then and uh, they're fine. But anyway, the meat and dairy industry are pretty nasty to the environment and the animals. I wouldn't go vegan for the animals though. <laughs> I wouldn't want to eat them alive. I'd much rather pay someone to kill them for me. Wait, what? <laughs> Am I? So they're acknowledging that the meat and dairy industry is horrible to animals and the environment. And we care about the environment because we care about the animals in it, right? But you wouldn't go vegan for the animals? <laughs> you say that in the next sentence? And you wouldn't want to eat them alive, but you you want you you want to pay someone else to kill them for it. I... <laughs> yes, that sub is a dumpster fire. No surprise it's full of edgy teenagers who tick off every robot omni response about preaching vegans. I, I want to know what subreddit it is so that I may avoid it eternally, so that I don't invite uh, untreatable illness into my life. I've been here too long. Is the blue one sarcasm? Surely someone with that much cognitive dissonance would never admit to having someone else murder something be morally okay. You know, I'm not sure either. I've seen too many deadpan, serious <laughs> responses like this to, to know at this point. That is all I have time for for the memes. Thank you ever so much for joining. And shout out to the vegan mooncat for giving me this excellent mug with a beanie on it. Look, we're matching. Totally cute. Why is that? I do hope you've enjoyed this episode of Vegan Memory. We love it. All right, but that's what we do. Do your neighbor a favor and share out the vegan memes. And if you like them, then obviously make sure to follow and subscribe. Don't forget to be a salad and not just a salad. I do hope you're well. And until next time, I will see you soon.